Momentum continues to build for Hamlin two weeks after he suffered cardiac arrest on the football field. CBS 2's Jennifer McLogan reports the AED used to save his life gained prominence 23 years ago thanks to one Long Island family pushing to have defibrillators in schools and on sidelines. America watching sudden cardiac arrest on the field. The life of Buffalo Bills star DeMar Hamlin hanging in the balance. This is exactly what happened to Lewis. Thinking about his mom and dad in the stands and how we felt. A surreal moment going back two decades for Karen and John Akampour of Northport, Long Island. They too were in the stands when their 14 year old goalie son Lewis collapsed after taking a lacrosse ball to the chest. You just think, well, they're going to get up. You don't think, you know, that they're laying there dying. They cheered on this storybook ending for DeMar Hamlin, reflecting on what might have been for Lewis. A captain of every team he was ever on, an honor roll student, and um, he could have brought you know, so much good to this world. It's all those what ifs, what ifs. And what if there was an AED on the field? Would he be alive? Yes. That day, 23 years ago, the Akampuras embarked on a mission. They did do CPR on Lewis, but EMS did not arrive for 15 minutes. Well, the only definitive treatment for a sudden cardiac death is defibrillation. Dr. Nidhi Kumar says for every minute that passes without defibrillation, chance of survival drops 10%. The police arrived, but they didn't have an AED on the car either. The Akamporas lobbied Albany and within a year all first responders were required to have an automated external defibrillator or AED. Next they got the ear of then Governor George Pataki who signed Lewis's law making it mandatory for every school and field in New York State to have an AED on the premises. And here we are at 110 lives saved in New York State schools, um, many of them athletes, young athletes. And you know, we know that we're doing the right thing. Karen and John now travel the country with Parent Heart Watch and the Lewis Agampora Foundation with the goal to get defibrillators in every school across America. Heart concussion of young athletes, at least 10 a year is what happened to Lewis. Commotio cordis, commotion of the heart caused by a chest blow, can be saved with an AED. We spend billions of dollars every year on youth athletics. I think we can throw some money towards safety. People will be saved uh, with CPR and a defibrillator in years to come and never heard the name Lewis Akinpora, so that's a real legacy. Turning pain into passion. From Northport, Long Island, Jennifer McLogan, CBS2 News.